R. Kelly pleaded not guilty to 10 criminal counts on Monday. The Grammy-winning R&B singer seen here surrendering to police spent the weekend in detention after he was ordered held on a $1 million bond. The 52-year-old is accused of sexually assaulting three teenagers and a woman. Yesterday, Robert Kelly was indicted before a Cook County grand jury on 10 counts of aggravated criminal sexual abuse involving four victims. The singer, despite his fame, faces a slew of financial problems and was unable to post the 10 percent collateral needed to walk free. His lawyer said Kelly is being held at a hospital for inmates for the singer's safety. It's just easier, frankly, for the sheriff to hold him there because if they put him in general population, you can imagine there'd be inmates who would want to maybe get after him, give him a hard time. Uh, it just is more secure in the Senate. Kelly wore an orange jumpsuit to the hearing on Monday, where a judge was appointed to preside over the criminal case. R. Kelly was acquitted of child pornography charges more than a decade ago, after a trial in which the alleged underage victim did not testify against him. In January, the Lifetime Television Network screened a six-part documentary series chronicling allegations of abuse by R. Kelly from multiple women. Mr. Kelly, anything you want to say about the allegations? Kelly, best known for his hit single, I Believe I Can Fly, has for years denied accusations of abuse.